This is a Spooman for Risk. Um, we're running just a brief video, teaching video, that should scare the daylights of any investor who is of the opinion that this rally is going to continue. What you're looking at right now is a daily VIX chart, volatility index. And we're running the VIX as you see from actually we can take this back 10 years right now here is where the trouble came last year when we concluded the month of August the VIX started to move up and it wasn't until uh, November or so that the VIX really started to turn back down and the rally that you've seen uh, ultimately uh, was headed up especially into the spring into May and we're still going down on the VIX or at least it looks that way the market has now rallied up why is it that we would think that this isn't going to continue there are two reasons number one we see divergence on the VIX when we apply an indicator. Now I'm going to go ahead and apply this indicator and what this indicator will do will show us divergence. Okay, But it is also going to show us gaps. Gaps. Gaps on the VIX is, have always, always always been filled. You will now see the significance of the gaps being filled when we turn on this indicator. I'm going to scroll back over the past as many years as this chart will take us. And I'm doing this rather quickly just to point out that all of these horizontal lines that you see are gaps. And every single one of these gaps has always been filled. Not some of the time. All of the time. So as we finally move into the last 12 months, notice what has happened. While the VIX is down around 25 right now, there are two major gaps on the VIX. One at 48.40 and one at 71.63. What does it mean? It means that the VIX is going to go back to 71.63. Now I don't know when it's going to get there. I just know that it will. And with the present economy as being in as difficult a position as it is, the likelihood that all of a sudden everything is rosy and we're going to continue on rallying up is baloney. That's not going to happen. So if you're an investor right now holding long positions, you ought to start thinking about taking profits on the basis of what this says. You, you can arrive at your own conclusion. I don't have to tell you that you should do, you should take any particular action, but you better be aware of this because this shows us that the VIX is going to go back up and it's going to go back up strong and as the VIX goes up the market's going to shoot down that's the way it works now let's apply one other indicator <coughs> this is a detrended price oscillator And if we simply look at where the 
lows of the DPO as we call it are hitting. As the VIX continues to move down, the detrended price oscillator is slowly moving up. Now it has come back down to about where it was in the previous, uh, at, the, at the very beginning of July. It's come down to about that same position. But what we would be concerned with here, if the VIX continues to move down below 23, which I rather doubt, I rather doubt, we could see it go down to as much as 2311, but um, I doubt that we're going to go back down to 23. In any case, if we get another move down in the DPO next week, we will likely be looking at a gap fill. There is an outstanding gap fill on the VIX, on the daily VIX, right there at 23.87. That will need to get filled. So the VIX will come back down at least to 23.87. We'll probably go a little lower than that. And we're going to watch very carefully where the DPO is. And if we see that the DPO is divergent, friends, that is spelling the probability that the rally is over and this market is going to start turning the other way. And it isn't going to look back. That's what the VIX says. You can read it yourself. You don't need me to tell you what's going to happen. Just read the VIX. And you have some very disconcerting issues when you see what's happening here. So, one more time. There's your future. it doesn't look very good. So from the standpoint of your portfolio, if you don't have a stop in on every piece of investment that you own, every instrument that you own needs to have a stop on it. This market is getting poised to turn the other way. And if you don't have a stop, think of what you will have lost. You already lost a ton. And for you to now lose more would be horrendous. You don't want that to happen. So, just a piece of information you need to be aware of. This is Spoo Man for Risk. Please, if you find this video interesting, please subscribe to our videos. Send me an email. Tell me that you appreciate what we just showed you. And today is July the 30th. Okay? We're about to go into August, and you know what happened last August. Subscribe to our videos. Look at our website, RSK sys.com got a lot of interesting things out there we've been telling our traders since May that this rally is just about over now we're even more sure of it so appreciate your comments make some comments by the way do that for us please uh, about the video and uh, keep in touch thanks for watching